Ever heard of Vomorolone? Well, if not, prepare for a journey into the world of recent medical advances. Vomorolone is a new class of drug called dissociative steroids that is being developed for the treatment of Duchenne muscular dystrophy (DMD). Duchenne muscular dystrophy is caused by a lack of a protein called dystrophin, which is crucial for muscle function. The lack of dystrophin causes muscle damage and inflammation resulting in progressive muscle weakness. Steroids are the current standard of treatment in DMD to reduce muscle inflammation and slow down the disease progression. Unfortunately, steroids have several side effects. By reducing this inflammation, Vamarolone aims to slow the progression of the disease and improve the quality of life for those affected. It is a dissociative steroid, which means that it has anti-inflammatory and muscle strengthening effects without many of the side effects associated with traditional corticosteroids, such as growth suppression, bone loss, and diabetes. So, how does Vomorolone work? It's relatively simple, actually. Vomorolone works by blocking a protein called mineralocorticoid receptor, MR. MR, when activated by stress hormones like cortisol, cause inflammation and muscle cell damage. Vamarolone blocks MR, which helps to reduce inflammation and protect muscle cells. Vamarolone, unlike other steroids, has much less transcriptional activation of genes linked to side effects. Now, let's delve into the clinical trial results of Vamarolone. Clinical trials are the critical proving ground for any new medication. Vamarolone has been shown to be safe and effective in several clinical trials in boys with DMD. In a pivotal phase 3 trial, Vamarolone was shown to slow the decline in motor function and improve muscle strength in boys with DMD, compared to placebo. Vamarolone was also associated with fewer side effects such as growth suppression, bone loss, and diabetes compared to prednisolone, a commonly used corticosteroid for DMD. But, like all medications, Vamarolone isn't without potential side effects. These can range from mild, such as fatigue or nausea, to more severe like weight gain, mood changes, or adrenal suppression, similar to prednisolone. It's important to remember, though, that the severity and likelihood of side effects can vary greatly from person to person. And what about the future of Vamarolone? Well, Vamarolone has recently received regulatory approvals from the FDA as well as the EMA, European Medicines Agency, for the treatment of children with DMD. The hope is that it could offer a new, more effective treatment option for Duchenne muscular dystrophy very soon. Vamarolone, then, is more than just a mouthful of syllables. It's a beacon of hope in the ongoing fight against Duchenne muscular dystrophy, a testament to the power of medical science and a potential game-changer for many affected children. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe to our channel to stay updated on the latest developments in medical science and genetic therapies. Together, we can spread awareness and support those affected by DMD.